good morning everyone it is saturday it is a new week of vlogs and i have a full weekend again what is this so today i'm going to go do some fun errands like a trip to kohl's and target and maybe a few things around the house plus more stranger things we still have four episodes left tomorrow i have some other errands and such to do because we are leaving on wednesday for florida so got a lot of stuff to do this weekend in order to prep for a little trip to florida this week mm -hmm. Okay, we're starting today's adventure at Kohl's. Yay, they're doing 20% off everything. I wish we could speak the truth. I wish we could start a lie. I wish we could make the road. So as you saw, that was a very successful trip. And with the sales and everything, I ended up getting eight tops, which one of them is a work shirt, right? I think one is a work shirt. And the rest were either summery tops for this trip or for the beach, for a future anniversary trip. Or even I got a shirt, one shirt? I think one shirt that I'm planning to save for Halloween Horror Nights. So eight tops just over a hundred dollars bless you Coles. I love you <laughs> I love Coles. so with that now I'm heading to Target to get a couple things that I need rather than want and uh, then I think it's time to head home not only are they doing 20% off today at Coles, but I got $20 of Coles cash so that means I have to come back <laughs> that's how they get you the ice cream aisle because supposedly there is Stranger Things ice cream from Scoops Ahoy here somewhere but I've already gone down the aisle and I haven't seen it yet so I might have to look at the app and see what aisle it's supposed to be on it might be on an end cap somewhere maybe I don't know but I want to find it also I did see these while hunting for it there are Halo Top little ice cream pops now. They're not great on carbs, so I'm not gonna get it. But if you're a Halo Top person, there you go. Found it. It was on an end cap. Hmm, they've got USS Butterscotch, which I think I have to get, right? And then Praline Portal, Shadow Sherbert, and Mint Flare, no, Mind Flare Mint. Hmm. Okay, so that was a fun trip into Target and I got Starbucks on the way out. So I wasn't feeling coffee today. So I got their new guava white tea lemonade. However, the Starbucks in the Target was out of white tea, so she made it with green tea. So I don't know how it's supposed to taste, but this one is delicious. I love guava things. So this is definitely like a perfect summer drink. Big fan. I was upstairs filming. Oh, hi. Oh, hello. Is everybody ready for mom to come downstairs? Is everybody ready for food? Are you hungry? Mom. Mom. <laughs> hey. Okay, this is good. Get you some exercise just going up and down the stairs. Are you hungry? Oh, yes. I know. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right, let me come feed you. I'm coming. Are you hungry, Bean? Are you hungry? Do you want food? <laughs> when Foster attacks. Oh, God. Oh, goodness. 
Oh, we're getting a whole show. Oh. All right, let's get you some food. Okay, so I filmed a couple videos, and now we're gonna go get some dinner. I found the dogs. Now, we're gonna go, it's sort of cheat, it is cheat day, but I'm taking it easy today. Not going crazy on the cheat day because I'm trying on wedding dresses this week. So I don't wanna lose the progress that I just made. And we're gonna go easy. We're gonna go to the wing place and I'm gonna get a delicious salad that's still keto, but I'm gonna allow myself. I already had some goldfish and I had my Starbucks. I'm gonna let myself have some raisinets while watching Stranger Things later. So baby cheat, not full cheat. Here's my salad. Yum. My, sure. My God, basically a buffalo chicken sandwich. Looks yummy. I'm excited. Okay, I've got my scoops ahoy, USS Butterscotch, and it's time for episode six. A blurry episode six. There we go. It's time. So here's my brunch today. Here's my brunch for today. I made some cheesy scrambled eggs and a little bit of ketchup, and that does have carbs, but I'm counting it, with some Tabasco that I still need to mix together and a little baby bell cheese. Time for some new nails. These did not last very long because I didn't go to my normal nail tech. So I am here with my normal nail girl for today and getting some new nails for today. Here is the after, got a pretty navy blue. It's really, oh, there we go. Really pretty in the sunlight. So it looks a little dull right now because it's got lotion on it, but it's super pretty. <laughs> I'm making dinner and I got a visitor. Hi, Bear. <laughs> Are you a lump? Are you a little lump? He's so funny. <laughs> this is fine, Dad. So I'm making keto white chili. And we're at this stage where I'm about to add the cream cheese and the whipping cream that's gonna make it the white chili. But I just wanna show it at this stage. Almost there. Cream cheese and whipping cream have been added and now it's gonna simmer for another 15 minutes. Get it all nice and mixed together. So there it is. Hopefully it's tasty. So we did stay up late last night and finish Stranger Things. So we have completed Stranger Things season three and it's just so early after it came out that I don't wanna talk about it in detail yet. Colby, that's rude. Well, he just ran by and like tackled Foster. So overall, I liked it better than season two, I think. It's been a while since I saw season two, so it's hard to directly compare, but I did like it overall. I thought, spoiler-free review here, I thought it was a lot more gory and a lot more action and a lot more people getting beaten up. So that was hard for me because I'm not good. As much as I love Halloween Horror Nights, I am not a horror fan. I don't like gore, I don't like violence, I am a wimp when it comes to those things. So I spent a lot of a lot of episodes staring at my phone, listening to what was happening but not actually watching. And the thing I really liked about the first season is the first time I watched it, I was so tense the whole time waiting for those things to happen and they never did. And part of that is just because they didn't have a budget for the first season, obviously, and now they do. So they're like, we're gonna show you everything! And I wish it was a little more subtle feel to it instead of all in-your-face action gore. But I know I'm in the minority on that. It's just how I feel about it. So otherwise, I did enjoy it. I got a lot of good laughs. I love these characters. Obviously, I really love the 80s aesthetic. It's my jam. 80s and 90s are always my jam. So I will always love a good romp back in the 80s and a good romper back in the 80s. So yeah, that's my spoiler-free review of Stranger Things. We both really enjoyed it. And now we wait a long time for season four. But we get to experience season two and three at Horror Night. So that's a thing at least. So good morning, everyone. It is Monday. Good morning. Good morning, Mike. Oh, everything's happening. Everything's happening. So I have a short day of work and then I have to go to Hyundai and get my plates because my plates came in. So it's exciting. 
And that's about it. Editing videos, because I've got two more videos that are coming out this week. And we're going to Florida this week. So pretty much gonna do that and then come home and just edit the rest of the day. So I just filmed the whole thing on this for the next Thin Lizzy update. But I just wanted to show them for the weekly vlog. I got uh, keto cereal. So you might be seeing me eat this the next few days. It's zero carbs per bag. And uh, I'm hoping it's delicious because that seems like it'd be really good, like kind of more dessert snack. So we shall see. Look how cute the box is and everything though. Bear. Bear, did you go running out in the rain by chance? Or are you running in the rain? Do you want a towel off? What, why did you decide to just go running through it? Don't rub your head on me. <laughs> I want to be dry, Mom. Your shorts will do it, Mom. Oh, yes, yes. Give me, I haven't even unwrapped it yet, Colby. I can't dry. <laughs> You're so funny. Dry me, Mom. I went romping through the rain, and now I need to be dried off, Mom. I'm wet. I don't like it. There we go. All right, let's get you all dried off. I'll use two hands. So good morning everyone. Happy Tuesday. I am heading off to work. It's my long day at work. And then when I get home, I need to start packing for Florida because we leave tomorrow night. Yay! Murder. Murder. Dogs are freaking out because the neighbor walks her dog every day at this time and they hate it. But this is what we're having for dinner tonight. We're gonna have the real good pizza company. We're gonna try their cauliflower crust. This is the one that I got for free with a coupon. And there it is. It doesn't look too shabby. We're gonna, we're gonna cross our fingers here. Review, it wasn't bad, but we liked the Quest pizzas better. So definitely the best real good food product we've had. It was cauliflower and almond flour crust, and so it just ended up being kind of doughy. And it was one of those things where the first piece was pretty good, and then after that you're just diminishing returns on how much you wanted to keep eating it, whereas the Quest pizza, this kind of more like normal, not great frozen pizza, I guess. It's kind of like Red Baron level of frozen pizza. So it's nothing fancy, no frills, but tastes like actual frozen pizza. This, you could tell was an imitation. So probably won't buy this again, but it was nice to have the free coupon and get to try it and find out if we liked it without having to spend the money. So hey, at least there's that. And uh, I'll stick to Quest products. So now I am in here starting to pack for our trip. And the good news about losing weight is that every single pair of shorts I own now fit because I had some shorts that I had grown out of. Now I fit back into them. The bad news is that I have way too many choices for shorts and it's crippling me. I'm having to try on everything and try on different outfits and does anyone else do this? But yeah, so I'm going to go through, pick out my outfits and uh, pack for the trip. Good morning, Bean. Out to enjoy a little sunbathe. So hello, it is Wednesday and I am headed off to work. My last day before our little mini vacation trip to Florida. So let's go get this thing done. Okay, so I'm home from work. Got my stuff all packed up. Mike's already packed up. And I have one very depressed dog. Two other ones that are concerned, but I have one very depressed pup. Look at this guy. He won't even hang out with me right now because you know. He's mad. <laughs> He's already mad at me. He's seen the suitcases. He knows what's happening. He's depressed. The other two are at least like following me around. Gold is just giving me the cold shoulder. To Tampa we go. Why? staying at a Hyatt place here in Bradenton. Actually, actually, I think this is Sarasota technically. But here we are. This is gonna be our home for the next few days. So it is 1 a.m. Florida time. So it is time for bed. But here's our view of the, uh, the UTC mall, which Brittany and I will be at two days from now. So it is time to go to bed and tomorrow it's time to go wedding dress shopping. So I need my sleep. See you tomorrow. Fashion. 
Sunshine, the sunshine. Sunshine Skyway. <laughs> sunshine Skyway. With this lovely Uber driver I got. Woohoo! <laughs> Are you tipping well? Of course. <laughs> Always. <laughs> Heading to our first bridal appointment. Wedding dress time. Detail is really pretty. Oh, I really like that one. Right. Okay, so the sleeves go all the way up on the shoulder. We're on a lunch break at the library in St. Pete. Look how cute it is. Look how cute it is. <laughs> awesome. Ooh, that looks so good. And there's Brittany's BLT, also looks super good. And fried green tomatoes, right? Yeah. <laughs> Delish. You're back in Florida. Sandhill Crane pair with uh, some twins that are almost grown up. They are almost ready to be on their own. But there they are, chilling at our hotel. Hello, Florida storms. They're on their way in. Oh, there it goes. Pouring over there. Gotta love it. Yeah, but she's not Robin. Hi, Mimi. <laughs> Do you love Uncle Mike? Yeah. <laughs> Do you love Uncle Mike? This is like, we just walked in the apartment like two minutes ago and you're like, okay. There'll probably be a time of the night where she's just warm. Oh. He's, he's got 
Oh, no. <laughs> it, no, it's gonna be like. There's also Kyle, not just Mimi. There's also Kyle. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> and Jordan. Hello. Hello. And that and that lady's back again. That person. That lady. Yeah. Our bartender over there. <laughs> She's back behind the bar where she belongs. <laughs> Drink, please. <laughs> Casa de pizza. Ooh. Window wings. Smell the wings. Oh, yeah. Yum. Casa de pizza. Oh. <laughs> yep. I literally walked over. And she's like, plop. And Mimi's got a new toy from Auntie Liz. He oh, yeah. did. <laughs> Oh, pizza. give me back my unicorn. <laughs> yeah, oh, she ran away. We missed the part where I was at Cory looking at Aw, bartender Brittany. Making the next round, wearing her cocktail shirt. Beer? Beer. It totally makes sense. So it's Friday, and it's day two of dress shopping. We're out in Sarasota now, dos. <laughs> We're out in Sarasota now going to one more shop. We think we found the dress yesterday. We're gonna give this other shop one try, well, probably multiple tries, <laughs> a visit. And we'll see if that other one can be beat. I don't know. I don't think so. <laughs> Shopping's done, we met Mike for lunch, and now we're going to the mall. And to get coffee. Yes, because Brittany needs caffeine. Because <laughs> you keep waking me up early. I've, I've exhausted her doing all this wedding dress shopping. She's hey, just like, Ugh. Hey, hey, I've been working really hard during these she has. visits, okay? She's like, been taking all the pictures, the video, all okay? the video she took. So everyone, when you see all these pretty dresses, it yep. was me, thank you. She did, she did some good work for you guys. <laughs> and for me. So now we're going into our other favorite place, UTC. Okay, we are here at Armature Works. The best. Yes. Back from, we had a girls weekend here last year. Yes. And this year, we have these boys with us. Yes. Everybody's together. Fun <laughs> friend time. They're, They're gonna just ignore me, it's fine. Welcome back to Armature Works. That Cuban food though. Oh my god, a Cuban. You could buy. We're upstairs this time for the first time. What's that? And it's pouring. So we're chilling. Okay guys, so we are back in our hotel room. And we said goodbye to Brittany and Jordan because we head back to Florida tomorrow. Or head back to Florida. We're in Florida right now. We head back to Texas tomorrow. So we had fun with them this evening at Armature Works and Copper Tail Brewery. And now we're back in our hotel room in pajamas, ready for bed. So that's going to be the end of this week's vlog. But I'll see you guys again next week and we'll have a whole chat at that point. So see you guys then. Bye. Oh,